1992, U.S. Meat produced 9 billion Lincoln cents in Denver and Philadelphia. Therefore, they are really common up to MS-67 grade. According to PCGS, in MS-68, it becomes much scarcer, but most collectors with small budget can still afford it. Only in MS-69 or higher, it's rare and expensive. What you have to pay attention is upper lettering on the reverse of the coin, if your pen is at higher mean state. That year there was a Lincoln cent design change on the reverse letters AM of America, which created a popular transitional variety. Today clothes AM at United States of America is considered very scarce and rare, and are worth thousands of dollars. Welcome back to CoinEyes, in this episode I'm going to show you what can make you really big money among 1992 pennies. So make sure to subscribe and hit bell button below this video, and let's get started. If you by any chance have close AM variety of 1992 issue in your collection, you have to know that they sell for really good amount even at relatively lower mid states. These 1992 descent at mid state 65 were rare close AM subtype, a transitional variety that has a reverse of 1993. The design subtype is identified by a close AM in America and distant FG initials from the Lincoln Memorial and was used on all proof and business strikes for 1993. Apparently a single reverse die intended to be paired with 1993D of verse instead was used to strike 1992D cents, likely shortly prior to the date transition. It was sold for $14,100 in 2014 at Heritage Auctions. And here is the most expensive example at midday 67 with close AM. It ended up selling for $25,000 and $850 at Heritage Auctions, a record price for this variety. Now let's see whether our briefly circulated Philadelphia Strack Lincoln Cent has close AM on reverse. As you can see, coin has preserved at least two-thirds of its peach orange luster, yet it has very distracting blemishes on right half of verse. Dark grey patination around the date and on the trust surfaces are almost untouched, just few insignificant ticks here and there. Most noteworthy contact marks are these abrasion on the right cheek of Lincoln and bag mark near the head. Reverse side exhibits more vibrant peachy tones. Here we have one massive tarnished stock on the roof of Memorial and some oxide layer on Lincoln's statue. Now let's closely inspect AM. As you see lower tips of letter A and M are widely spread from each other, therefore no close AM here. Memorial steps display one abrasion resembling a lightning. Overall appealing is not that bad. It is at about uncirculated grade. For the last, I would like you to show you the guiding price list for higher grades of 1992 close AM varieties. Don't forget to hit the like button and have an extremely fine day.